This is for kids only. My grandpa's a city councilman. Say so this is for kids only. Hey kids, Petaluma Pete here, and we are at City Hall today. We're going to learn a new word. That word is dayas. Of course, a lot of Petaluma Pete say dayas. Don't ask me why. Maybe I'm wrong. But Webster says dayas. Would you like to know more? Come with me. Day is, kids, is described as a raised platform, as at the front of a room, for a lectern, throne, or seats of honor. You can see a day is all the time when you watch Petaluma Pete's favorite TV channel, Petaluma Public Access Channel 28. It's a city hall thrill a minute. So we decided to get on over there and show you the city council chamber. Upon our arrival, however, we opened the door and discovered all these adults standing in our way. There they were, cluttering up our path to the city council chamber in the distance. Somebody said this was a swearing-in reception, but we didn't hear any swearing. As a matter of fact, everybody was being really nice to one another. This made Petaluma Pete feel all warm and fuzzy, kids, because these adults were setting a good example for all Petaluma citizens by coming together as one with a positive, productive, friendly, caring, focused team spirit for the betterment of all. That's called leadership. And that's what sets adults apart from kids. Kids. It's nice to be nice to the nice. So we smiled as we made our way through the crowd and just kept our eye on the objective. Besides, we knew we were guests and letting anyone know we were there to learn about the day is was a subject we just did not want to broach. The first thing we noticed was the video cameras that are used to capture the proceedings up on the day is and broadcast everything to you on PCA TV channel 28. These cameras have been installed up high, all over the room, kids, and one of them is pointed at this lectern, where Petaluma citizens stand and speak into a microphone when addressing our council members. The next thing we noticed was what they call an electronic voting board. This apparatus shows everyone who voted which way. Another dandy feature for people watching PCA TV Channel 28. We then noticed a row of seats right up front, set aside for city staff members. Reserved front row seats can be expensive, kids, so this was another indication of how nice everyone is to one another here at City Hall. The crowd was getting bigger, kids. People were coming from all over town. They were all dressed up for one another and laughing and shaking hands telling wonderful stories, catching up on old times, introducing new council members, sharing a joke or two, taking pictures of family and friends, and through it all, nobody was swearing about anything. So we turned our attention to the subject of our visit, kids. The Petaluma Day is a magnificent sight to behold. People say you can tell a lot about a person by how neat or messy their desk is, kids. Some say a messy desk is the result of a disorganized thinker, while others say a neat desk is a reflection of someone with too much time on their hands. My dad used to say a neat desk indicates an organized professional, while others say a messy desk shows creativity and openness. Also, adults can be funny, kids, unlike yourself. They can be a little forgetful, which is why you always see their names on little name tags and on signs like this, so they can remember who everyone is, including themselves. So all across the front of the day is here at the Petaluma Council Chamber, you will find these really cool little name signs. Finally, on the day is, you will usually find a gavel. This gavel is unique for Petaluma because upon close inspection, kids, we discovered a chicken. That's right, a chicken sitting in a nest carved right into the wood. Well, that about wraps it up, kids. As always, remember to be nice to everyone. Listen to your teachers. 
and eat more veggies.